I found I found Charles Davidson's article in the Federal Reserve uh, Bank of Atlanta uh, quite interesting. Uh, it had something to do with um, sports still drawing uh, fans despite the recession. Uh, it was back in 2009, and he had some interesting uh, uh, facts supporting uh, his ideas of sports and their interaction uh, with stimulating the, an economy. Uh, for facility managers, uh, they have a great task uh, at hand dealing with uh, such an economic shortage or slow time. Uh, consumers are still buying, but uh, Mr. Davidson said that uh, ticket sales, uh, technology, and construction were some of the things that facility managers can use uh, in order to increase revenue uh, in this time of uh, economic uh, downturn. Um, Technology, even in the form of social media, has picked up lately uh, and given uh, stadiums and those of the sort an opportunity to get more fan and uh, social interaction throughout their community. Uh, TV contracts have been big uh, with uh, sport broadcasting companies such as ESPN. Uh, they're finding uh, lucrative deals that they're, they're inking out to these colleges to get these uh, young athletes on television. Uh, television seems to dominate America, so in order to use a facility for television purposes, those advertising dollars on the cable network are very advantageous. Um, I thought that there was two things that could be more beneficial for facility managers to uh, maximize during the economic downtime. Uh, one being innovation. And when I say innovation, I'm, I mean uh, innovation through training. Uh, there's a lot of companies in general who uh, lack the, the advisory support or the technical support to teach their staff how to uh, run the facility or, 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 or run the organization. Uh, there's been a lot of times where uh, there's been a lot of staff firings, and I think it is more due to the result of incompetence than it is to just cut back on spending. Uh, of course, cutting back is... Uh, going to be ne uh, necessary to help you know elevate growth, but uh, I feel like training can help inspire innovation throughout the uh, within the company itself. Uh, with your employers having increased job satisfaction and being excited about being a part of the organization, they can uh, that can lead to um, more thinking outside the box or more opportunities uh, coming from people who are already familiar with your organization and trying to help it grow. I also think that um, diversity can play a big role in increasing uh, revenue for facility managers and their operations, uh, even hosting events uh, that can help uh, cultures uh, kind of mesh or even a learning center where uh, you can learn how to speak a language uh, or just having festivals and theme are reverence uh, to particular cultures so that people within the community can be involved and uh, get acquainted to uh, the many cultures that are around them. They're around them all day. Uh, so to, to be able to provide a means or a grounds where they can uh, come together and interact on the common uh, setting can help stimulate the, uh, the community and uh, help bring it together uh, at the same time. I think uh, those are two things that the facility managers can take advantage of. And uh, those are my thoughts.